Good morning, guys. It is 7.30. I think there's something wrong with the clock in here. It says 7.30 and I'm being whipped with a crop. And ow, it really hurts. Don't whip me with that crop. I'll whip you. It is almost one o'clock in the afternoon. <laughs> Sophie is already on the gallop this morning. And we are headed out. We are headed out to a birthday party for my daughter-in-law. For you guys who are new subscribers, you might not know that I have three older sons and the oldest one is married to Stacy and it's Stacy's 30th birthday. Maybe I wasn't Wait, supposed she's to- Wait, 30? Yeah. Maybe I wasn't supposed to tell you how old she is, but anyway, she's having a big party and the grand our grandchildren are gonna be there and it's a pool party and we are ready to head out and have the best time. I thought I'd do a quick little update on Bailey Bird. Yesterday he was squawking like a crazy bird. And so today, uh, or last night, <coughs> I closed these blinds. Can you guys see these blinds that we have out here? on the porch and just kind of helps him a little so he's still acclimatizing to being outside and hearing the other birds and eating bugs and all that kind of stuff. So he was getting stressed out when all the people would be walking by and stuff. So now that I closed him in a bit, he's a little better. I'm gonna feed him before we go. Yesterday, Sophie found a bunch of worms and put them in Bailey's bowl. What did Bailey do with those worms, Soph? He ate them all. Put them in the water, in his water to clean them. Yeah, wasn't oh, that cool? He did? Yeah. As soon as she gave him the worms in his bowl, he took every single worm, dumped it in his bucket of water, and cleaned them before he ate them. I love that. He's just such an amazing little guy. So for lunch, I have a bag of steak for him. I'm always worried he's gonna make a run for it when I open his crate, cage. There you go, my love. I'm gonna give you lots. And when we come home, I'll give you some fruit. There's Betty. So uh, one day this week, later in the week, oh, I'm dreading it, we will open the cage and let him fly for a while. Okay, come in. She locked me out. Come on. Let me in. Come on, oh thank you. You better run. Anyway, this morning we woke up late and that's why the video got posted a little bit later than normal. It took us a long time to edit it last night, so it took a long time for it to render. But I woke up this morning and my goal this morning was to uh, fix, oh! <laughs> she is heavy. Anyway, my goal this morning was to get a bunch of homeschool stuff done and so this is what I got done. I have all of our stuff organized here. I've got this bucket here is all of a Gabby's curriculum. Look at, she even has this horses and pony activity book, but she's got math and she's got literacy and she's got grammar and she's got spelling. She's got all that stuff. And then Sophie has all this stuff. I always get the most stuff for Sophie. So she's got math and she's got language and spelling and all that kind of stuff. So these are all of our curriculum, and then this is a bunch of our craft stuff here. Another part of my goal for this week is to organize this playroom so that we can use it into, make it into like a school room. Um, I haven't shown you this. This is all of our textbooks. All of our learning books are right here. It goes all the way down to the ground there. These are all of our learning books. And then over here is our library. So uh, those are for the grandkids down there. They're like preschool books. And then this one is all the books that I plan to read to the girls this, this year. Um, these are all Gabby's books. So when she's ready to read, she can choose from any of these books when it's her reading time. These are all Sophie's books. And then these are a mixture of all of our books. Some Gabby, some Sophie's. So we have our own a little library and yeah, I have a lot more to do before we start back to school, but I'm excited to get it all started. I'm excited to get this room fixed up so that we can use it as a school room. Yeah, I'm excited for school to start. Another crazy thing that happened last night was that somebody was able to talk me into bringing all the schleich back downstairs. Gabby and Sophie brought all their schleich downstairs last night, right? Yeah. They have a whole new setup on the dining room table. Wow, where's your new girl? Gabby just got a brand new girl. I guess it's this girl right here. Yeah. And these are all Sophie's girls. We need Except to get, for that one. We need to get our briar stuff out. And guys, this is my new horse. That's her new. Oh, the tack. Oh, I love the tack. That horse looks really good. 
That's looks great. way better. Looks way better with the tack on it. Super cool. So they got all their stuff out there. And I didn't show you guys what we did after Abby was gone. We cleaned out her crate and we moved the big, the little dogs into the bigger crate because before they were staying in a smaller crate. So yeah, let's let them outside for a pee. So we moved them in there. There they come outside. So it just Oops. jumps out. And we bought them that nice, cozy, new bed which they absolutely love and they're wondering about their food and water in there basically when abby was alive she would always eat their food and drink their water so we always started um feeding them in their pen in their crate and that's what we that's when we put them in at like three times a day we put them in there so that they're eating enough and because our chihuahuas are so tiny we actually free feed them that means that we just leave their food and their water in there and they can eat whenever they want <laughs> no Look at what we were playing. I have a surprise for you. You have a surprise for me? Yeah, come okay. on. Okay, okay, I'll come and see. This is what so I fall last kind of. Oh my goodness. Can we get chairs? Ah, uh, sure. Can you look at this alley. Oh, oh, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I want to get these big glasses. I don't, I don't have these. Don't have oh, okay. This mask. I want this. Tomorrow I have That's my baby. Ah, here. Have this mask. Work. Have a mask. Or you could get it like this color. Okay. Sophie, come on, we're gonna get a picture. Oh, it's backwards. It's what a mustache? Oh, it's like a good lips. Oh, it's like a lips. Okay. That definitely Let's go. Yeah. But yeah, so I'm hoping it was a glass. But also, like, it might have just been like. Like, they have to zero the scope. It counts down 10 seconds. It takes four shots. scope, like, so obviously you have like a barrel that's got whatever, and the scope could be a little off either way. So, so it might look like you're shooting right, but actually you're shooting straight. Right. But they really don't care, like, because they want to get out of there, so they're like, like, you shoot, and then they're like, all right. All right, so we are at the birthday party, and I have a special guest here. <gasps> Brooklyn. <laughs> Brooklyn. Yay! We are, we are getting ready to swim in this pool. Yay! Yeah. I don't know my baby suit on yet. Are you going to swim with me though? Yeah. Yeah, I'm going to swim with you. I can swim by myself. I know, but I'm going to go in the pool with you. Hey, how did you learn to swim? When did yeah, you learn to swim? I didn't know. Can you jump now? No, I can't. Oh, I bet you could. You're going in super slow motion. Hey, I can't swim to it. <laughs> that means I'm not nice. Brooklyn, what's in the pool? There she goes. Here goes Gabby. What did it break, Sophie? Oh. Uh, okay. Is it warm? It feels warm. Where's them? Where's them? Nice and deep. I have one. There goes Sophie. Brooklyn, when the birthday cake comes out, Nana will get you a piece. <laughs> Time for cake. I've been dying for cake. Yeah. <laughs> 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 You're brave, Kathleen. Let me get a towel. To you. Happy birthday to you. Uh -oh. Happy birthday, dear Stacy. Happy birthday to you. Hey! There you go. There's your daughter. Hold on. Uh oh, sorry. Brooklyn, you want to help me blow the cake? Hey, the girls are coming. Hey, you don't need to help mom? You guys don't need to blow it out. Just drip Ready? on it. The three of you guys are waterlogged. <laughs> 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 Yeah. <laughs> Jacob's like, give me the cake. Give me the cake. <laughs> yeah. the cake. Go ahead. Cake, he says. Oh, it's your fingers on. Your fingers all like a boob. Oh, there you go. Is that good, dude? Oh, that's the way to do a bunny. Is that a good boy? Yeah, that was good. Good? Good? Yeah. Yeah. Right. Oh, oh, dude. He's trying to just take a small piece. 
Uh, wait, okay. You want the right piece of the rainbow? Okay. Go sit down and I'll bring you the rainbow. Jacob, stop eating the cake. Let me see your face. Let me see your dirty old face. Let me see. Don't. Yeah. Don't go in the cage. Is this the same <laughs> no more cake. Is awesome. Is he eating cake? Brooklyn. Is that good cake? Is that good cake? Look at, look at Jake. Look at Jacob. Can <coughs> mm, have some bananas? Yeah, we can. You can both share. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Uh, what did you get? A white piece? A white piece of cake? Oh, you like the chocolate better? Cool. Oh, no, Jacob oh, likes here. both of them better. Mm, I think you like the chocolate. You guys, it is pitch black. We are still at the birthday party. If you guys are confused, the birthday party is for my daughter-in-law, and she is the mother of this gorgeous boy. He's and all dirty because he's been eating cake. And he's say hi. Hi. Hi, friends. Put these chairs say, I'm Jacob. You. No, I'm not. Oh, All right, so, boy. so they have this really cool thing here. It's a photo booth. Oh, who's this boy? Who is this boy? I'm Brooklyn. You're in Brooklyn. That's a girl's name. Aren't you a boy? No. You've got a mustache. <laughs> no. I'm Brooklyn, and <laughs> well, that's that's one of these ones. Oh, yeah. She's got, they got all these props for the photo booth. I don't care. Oh, look at this cute girl. You guys recognize her? She already got bites. Yeah, she's got bites all over her. But I don't. No. Okay, get up there. They have all these props here. Masks. I can't see a thing. Okay, get over there. All right, you guys, you can take that first. these are my two daughter-in-laws. This is Stacy and this is Kathleen, married to my oldest son, my middle son, and we're doing a birthday picture. All right, let's do it. Okay, let's do it with your camera. Okay, she's got her camera. Ready? All the kids are in the pool having a nighttime swim. Brooklyn! You, this is your first time nighttime swimming? Yeah, we did it. That's amazing. There's Gabby and Sophie right there. There's Jesse, that's Nick's girlfriend. There are my boys right there. Look at them wrestling. And there's Kyle fighting with me. <laughs> Chloe, can you guys see her? This is my son's dog. It's Chloe. She's a German Shepherd. And she's so pretty. She's been making me miss Abby all day just because she's big and she reminds me so much of Abby because she's such a good dog. We are home from the party. It's 9.30, you guys. The girls are still up. We're just getting them ready for bed. They sent us home with a ton of cake. So that's super yummy. Girls are getting their pajamas on. Uh, Sophie, I washed all Sophia's sheets last night, so I have to make her bed. Just wait, you can't make your white eyes. You know those times when you spend so much time having fun and then you get home and you're like, oh man, I have so much to do. I have to edit the vlog and that takes forever. But anyway, before I end today's video, I wanted to talk about something. Okay, so a lot of you. Oh, let me just end the vlog. Good night, bye. Bye. Anyway. I just wanted to say something about um, Pure Equine Spirit. She is an 11 year old little girl and she has a YouTube channel and it's called Pure Equine Spirit. And she commented this today. She wrote, day by day, I'm quitting YouTube because of the haters. More bigger, to, more bigger YouTubers are hating on me. Thanks for supporting me, but I just can't take it anymore. Sorry, no more vids from me. You should unsubscribe from me. I suck as a YouTuber. Everyone says, I just can't take it. So I just wanted to talk about how there are haters everywhere you go. It doesn't matter where you are. It doesn't matter how good you are at stuff. People are always going to say negative things about you. Usually when people hate, it has nothing to do with you. It's jealousy. It has to do with them. Sometimes they're jealous, like Gabby said. Sometimes they just don't understand. Sometimes they don't know better. Lots of times people don't know better than to say mean things. But it's rarely ever your fault when people hate on you. I just wanted to say never give up your dreams because of somebody else. God has a divine purpose for your life, for your life alone. And if you stop living it because somebody else says you shouldn't, then you're giving up the life that God has planned for you. You need to just do your 
your own thing and ignore the haters. They're going to be everywhere all the time. Just don't pay attention. If anybody knows about haters, it's us. Like we are an expert on haters now. So anyway, I just wanted to talk about that for a minute and I wanted to tell her that we are here for you and um, take some time and think about it. You don't have to close your channel just right away because I know you're feeling frustrated and upset and sad, but just take a rest and just come back to it when you're able. Sometimes that's all you need is just a rest. But anyway, that is it for today. We are going to end today's vlog. Oh, but before I do, I wanted to tell you guys, we were at that party from, from 1 o'clock in the afternoon till 7 o'clock till 9.30 at night. And I didn't have time to answer any of your guys' messages or even hardly comment on any of your comments. But um, it's just because we are away. So tomorrow I'll be back to normal. So we're going to say good night. And thank you so much for watching this video. And thank you so much for subscribing and being a part of our family. Right? Good night. Good night. Bye. Good night, guys. Don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.